Today I'm really excited because I'm making one of my favorite cocktails, a drink that is kind of not known very well, kind of rare if it ever gets ordered behind the bar, but it's one of my favorites. It's Cuba's answer to the very popular Manhattan, and that is the El Presidente. So the El Presidente was created by an American bartender, Eddie Wolke, while bartending at the Jockey Club in Havana, Cuba. He fled the US during Prohibition looking for work, and he made this drink, which was actually already a popular cocktail. And all he did is he added a little bit of dry curacao, renamed the drink after President Gerardo Machado, and boom, this is kind of the version of the El Presidente that we all know and love today. So let's talk about what you need to make the drink. So first we're gonna need an aged rum. I'm gonna go with the classic Havana Club for this one. And next you're gonna need a vermouth blanc. Now I'm actually gonna use the Lay, which is very similar, but I really like it in this cocktail. And then we're gonna need a dry curacao and some grenadine. And lastly, we're gonna need an orange for the orange peel as a garnish. So a couple things before we get started. First of all, I like to use Lillet in this cocktail. You just need a vermouth blanc. Traditionally, it's made with a regular vermouth. Uh, Lillet, to me, tastes very similar and I actually really like it in this cocktail. So go with either one, see which one you like the best. And lastly, this is a pretty simple cocktail, so we do wanna make sure we're using a good grenadine for this one. I'll link up my grenadine recipe right here. You guys can go check out. It's really easy to make or I'll link some of my favorite grenadines that you can buy down below. Just make sure you get a good one for this cocktail. And that's pretty much it. Let's build the drink. We're gonna be stirring this cocktail, so go ahead and grab your mixing glass. And the very first thing we're gonna do is add one quarter of an ounce of dry curacao. Then we're gonna add one and a half ounces of our vermouth blanc. And then we're gonna add one and a half ounces of our aged rum. And lastly, we're gonna add one bar spoon of grenadine. Go ahead and fill your mixing glass up with ice and we're gonna give this a stir for about 30 or 40 seconds. You can use any stem glass of your choice and then go ahead and strain your drink into the glass. Lastly, we're gonna grab an orange peel and we're gonna express a little bit of oil over the glass. And I like to actually curl mine up and set it on top of the glass here. And there you go, you got yourself an El Presidente. Not gonna lie, I'm pretty excited about this one, so let's give it a try. Mm. That is so good, so well balanced. You get a little bit of that burnt sugar from the aged rum, you get orange flavor, you get some herbalness from the Lillet Blanc, and a little bit of tartness from the grenadine. It's super delicious, very well balanced. Uh, I do also like to experiment with this drink a little bit. I like to add a little bit more rum sometimes. So if you wanted to do two ounces of rum, one ounce of Lillet, kind of gives it more of a rum forward flavor, which is also really good. So experiment with the two and see which one you like. But either way, this drink is dynamite. You gotta give it a try. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, tell your friends about the channel. You know what to do. We'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.